Arizona is turning 100 years old this year, and the people and traditions that make it unforgettable continue to truly enrich life here daily. One of those traditions is the passing of family recipes from generation to generation, and we want to welcome Haley Gibbons, a fourth-generation native here. You're such a rarity. I am. I am. <laughs> Great Thank to have you. you here. Tell me a little bit about your family history. Well, as you said, we're one of the pioneering um, families in Arizona. Mm -hmm. uh, we got here in uh, 1876, wow. and we established cattle ranches in southern Arizona. Truly amazing. Yeah. How much times have changed, huh? It, oh, yes. You brought food, because food really plays a role when it comes to families and passing things down from generation to generation and these are really special dishes to you these are these are very special um, these I know of um, from my grandma Lupi mm -hmm. and my grandma Lupi passed before um, I was born so I never got to meet her yeah. but I feel like I know her just through our recipes mm -hmm. and that's um, you hear about reenactments of different wars and things like that for us to connect with each other mm -hmm. this is the way that I connect is through food and these are the same dishes dishes that I'm eating today that I'm sharing with you that my grandmother had and her mother had and before that. It's like so. a part of her has always stayed with you and will continue yeah. to stay within your family. Absolutely. We yeah. have nieces um, and and further generations that already know how to make our tacos. And I know that you were saying mm -hmm. earlier, you said, I know it sounds a little weird to have radishes with peas. And I said, no, it doesn't. Mm -hmm. I mean, you know, it's that's what makes family is unique and that's what makes food that is you know that you have grown up with so special yeah absolutely this is uh, as I said my grandma loopy tacos and it is it's it's what's unique. Anybody knows a Grandma Loopy taco. Once you've had one, you know it. And it's because of these items that are in it that you can't find anywhere else. Absolutely. You know what? We also have some pictures that you yeah. wanted to share with us, too. So talk us through some of these pictures mm -hmm. that you wanted to share with our viewers. Well, that's my Grandma Loopy at this tiny um, four-burner stove right there. And that's her with her sister. And that's back in, probably in the 20s there. Mm -hmm. And then that's um, at the ranch there as well. Back in the 1800s? Yeah. Wow, Here's um, some so of the far. cattle and they have, you can't see them quite close, but they have unique um, brands on there of the family. And who's that little girl? That's, it's a little itty bitty guy and that's a distant oh. relative oh. of ours that, that, but you start them young back then. And He's then there's the cattle. ranch hand, uh, or the ranch uh, house there. That's my beautiful. mother. Oh my goodness, yeah. she is beautiful. And that's her. She has a unique history to Arizona, too. She was in the first graduating class of the U of A that accepted women in the College of Pharmacy. Wow. And what that's an my great-grandparents there. And they're the ones that came um, as little boy. He was here in 1876. Those yeah. are such precious pictures. Yeah. What gems. Thank yeah. you so much for sharing oh, that with us. thank you so much. Thank you.